car is doing it all itself. For Joshua Brown, the Tesla automobile was a thing of beauty. He it loved the futuristic the car's autopilot self-driving feature. It takes all the stress out of it. Brown was such a fan, he posted several videos on YouTube of his travels in the car. He even gave it a nickname, Tessie. Now comes the shocking revelation that Brown has become the first driver to be killed in a self-driving car. It happened near Gainesville, Florida, when his car slammed into a tractor trailer that was making a left turn. In a statement, Tesla says, neither autopilot nor the driver noticed the white side of the tractor trailer against a brightly lit sky, so the brake was not applied. 40-year-old Brown was an American hero, having served as a Navy SEAL in the fabled SEAL Team 6, the unit that killed Osama bin Laden. He was a thrill seeker and even jumped out of planes. Brown had one close call with his Tesla. This video shows the car avoiding an accident when a truck pulled into his lane. Tessie did great, he said on his YouTube channel. I am very impressed. It was the last video he ever posted. Tesla's founder, billionaire Elon Musk, tweeted, our condolences for the tragic loss. It is not a toy, it is not a game. Car safety Again, expert like Lauren Fix has this warning about self-driving technology. This is not ready for prime time. It's the same as owning a pet crocodile. You never know when it's gonna bite. Self-driving cars can take your breath away. Remember this 70-year-old's first time in a Tesla? Oh, oh, is the car coming? One question hanging over Brown's death. The accident happened on May 7th, but is only now coming to light. Two months later, Tesla says it notified federal officials immediately after the crash happened. According to one report, the truck driver says Brown was watching a Harry Potter movie when the crash occurred. But the truck driver tells Inside Edition that never happened. The car's doing it all itself.